Hello, my Pisces. This is your mid-month for the 15th through the 31st. <clears throat> for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Wow. I've got cards popping up here. I'm not ready yet, though, but wow. Um, if you're new to the channel, welcome, guys. Thank you for coming. If you are interested in a personal reading, that information is down below the video, okay? Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. All right, guys. Celtic Cross, here we go. Let's see what the energy is surrounding you guys, okay? We have the Ten of Pentacles in reverse which is odd because all of my cards in the upright so when it comes like that i leave it like that okay it's the way it's supposed to be okay so that is the energy that is surrounding you let's see what your challenge is here the magician what is the issue the hanged man let's see what was going on for you guys in the past the Page of Swords. Hmm. What's the best outcome here? It's the Four of Swords. Hmm. What's coming in for you guys? The Four of Pentacles. How you see yourself here. It's the Nine of Wands. What's your outside influence? It's the Queen of Wands. Hmm. What's your hopes? The Three of Pentacles. And your fears? It's the Eight of Cups. Let's see your overall outcome here. Mm, that's a nine of pentacles. All right. So good outcome. All right. So the energy that is surrounding you right now is the fact that um, I think you guys have gone through a breakup with someone who you felt like you probably were going to spend the rest of your life with here. Okay. And I think that is like was very significant with you. Your challenge is to get up and keep moving, knowing that whatever you put your mind to, that you can accomplish that, okay? Ooh, these hands are ashy. <laughs> Hold on one second, guys. I'm looking at them on this computer. Uh, I'm just going to continue talking, though, okay? So... Is knowing that you can do whatever it is that you put your mind to. To know that um, just because this relationship is over does not mean that your life is over. Does not mean that you cannot have everything that you want, including a stable, committed relationship. Somebody that feels about you the way that you feel about them as well okay now how you see in yourself is the nine of wands here okay um and this is good because this is strength this is knowing that you can go on regardless of what you've been through regardless if you feel like you have been tortured before you know you pick yourself up and you move right past that bull crap okay this is how you're viewing yourself like yeah i've been beat down um i've been done wrong but you know what i'm gonna keep it moving okay so what the issue here is is that you guys have been beating yourself up way too long you've been stuck okay it is time to make moves Leave that energy behind of what you lost here and keep it moving. Keep it moving. Okay? Now, in the past, I feel like there were lots of things that, you know, lots of scenarios that you were playing over in your head about the situation. How can you move forward from this? Um, just trying to get like a strategy together. Maybe you felt like, you know, there was not a whole lot you could do about this, but, you know, you were planning, 
you were planning. I feel like you were praying um, and you were you were basically disciplining yourself here is what I'm getting here. I feel like, too, that, you know, there is a possible air sign here in your reading that probably gave you the silent treatment here. They probably, I don't know, it feels like um, some ghosting going on. Maybe somebody just stopped talking to you and you don't even know why. Somebody that you felt like, you know, this is my partner. So it kind of left you feeling like stuck and like, okay, what just happened here? Okay. But the best possible outcome here is that um, <laughs> you get over this. That you heal from whatever wrong was done to you and um, you keep it moving. You keep it moving. If they don't talk to you, you don't worry about them not talking to you. Because guess what? Um, you don't even want to talk at this point. You just want to be over this. And I think, <coughs> excuse me, that is, that is what you're doing here. Because what's coming in for you is stability. Stability. Okay. Also, this is some, this is an energy to you guys where, you know, you've been hurt before. And so you're really not trying to allow anything to come in to like mess with your stability. You just not want to take that chance. Four is a very stable energy. So you're not talking. You're not allowing anything to interfere with what you have going on currently because, you know, it's taking you some time to get to the point where you're like, you know what, I can get up and I can go on. But you're not allowing anything, you know, lending your time and your energy to things that you feel like can, um, like, ruin where you've come thus far is what I'm feeling here. Now, your outside influence is the Queen of Wands. Okay? Now, this is a fire sign here. Hmm. Does not have to be a woman, but I feel strongly that this is a woman in this particular spread. Um, and I feel like this is mostly involving, like, I'm, who I'm talking to right now, I feel is a very male energy. Okay, I'm just getting that strongly here. I think there is somebody that you guys probably still are kind of hung up on. Somebody that's very mature, also very fiery, very confident in themselves here. Um, I think she can be very flip at the mouth, you know, very fiery, um, does not mind saying exactly what's on her mind, does not mind walking out on you if while you're talking even. <laughs> I mean, you know, that type of energy is what I'm getting. Um, somebody that probably, you know, did stop talking to you. Um, you guys probably are not talking to each other. But I feel like they still keep like they still keep an eye on you, whatever that means. Not saying that she rides by your house. I'm not saying that. Maybe she keeps a watch on your social media page. Maybe she's here watching um, tarot readings as well. Okay, could be a cross watcher here, even. All right, but this person has I feel a lot of influence over this situation right here now what your hopes are is a three of pentacles i feel like you know this is you guys wanting to be with somebody that you can build with and have a very solid future with okay i, I just feel like that you're wanting to now whether or not it's this fire sign i kind of think it is okay i kind of think it is Let's see, guys. Maybe has some air in their chart. Um, maybe you have some air in yours as well. But, um, yeah. All right. So, in your fears, we have the Eight of Cups. Hmm. 
one of you walked away. Whoever initially walked away is afraid that if they try to um, work on this relationship again, they're afraid that the other person will do the same thing that they did previously. Very cut and dry, bottom line. Very cut and dry. So if this fire sign walks away, I feel like you know they want to come back together and they want to work on this relationship, but they're afraid that Pisces is going to walk away, that you're going to have some get back. Okay, flip flop it if you need to, but only you guys know your situation here. Okay, so in the overall outcome, we have I can pick it up. We have the Nine of Pentacles. Okay, so I do feel like you guys, you guys, well, this fire sign right here is single. Okay, I'm getting that strongly. Um, maybe she has Virgo in her chart, Capricorn even. Um, but I feel like she is single if some of you are wondering that she is single. Okay, um, but also this is you guys feeling confident enough um, to go after that 10th pinnacle again with this person if that's what you want or even with someone else if that's what you choose okay but you will gain the confidence um, to to go whichever way you feel like you want to go because you're coming here as a nine of wands and the nine of pentacles two very single cards okay so if you choose to be single um, from this person then I see you guys doing that successfully but if you're choosing to like go after that ninth pinnacle after you get your footing you get your grounding then I see you doing that as well so I don't feel like you guys can go wrong here whatever you choose as long as you do what you feel is right okay what you feel is right not when at all costs but what you truly feel is right and just in this situation okay my Pisces friends so I will be speaking with you guys soon